If you're looking for the best budget baby monitor, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have VTech upgraded audio baby monitor. The VTech D Mon 111 is a bare bones audio option that transmits audio without the bells and whistles of a more expensive product. The VTech D Mon 111 relays sound from the nursery to the parent device with excellent sound quality and no confusing features to set or worry about. This device is a simple plug and play baby monitor. This is remarkably easy to use, making it an excellent option for parents who aren't tech savvy or for grandma who might be intimidated by a monitor paired with advanced features. This product is the least expensive choice in our sound monitor review, but you won't be sacrificing sound quality or usefulness for a lower price. This monitor doesn't include sound activation, so there can be some white noise transmitted to the parent device which could be disruptive to quality parent sleep if white noise isn't your thing. The consistent sound may not be a deal breaker if it comes from a fan or noise maker in the baby's room, and some parents feel the sound is conducive to sleeping or can provide reassurance that the device is working. The VTech DMO 111 is an excellent option for anyone on a budget who wants to hear their baby but doesn't require the extra features found in more expensive contenders or monitor types. It is also so wallet-friendly that it makes a great backup to a movement or video monitor or as a travel choice. Moving on to the next at number 2 with VTech Dem 221 Audio Baby Monitor. The VTech Dem 221 has the basic sound monitoring features parents need, combined with the best sound quality and clarity results in our test. The VTech Dem 221 one is easy to use sound activation and adjustable mic sensitivity to help parents create a quiet room for optimal sleeping potential with a parent unit that only transmits sound when the baby cries. The VTech Dem 221's talk to baby function sounds natural on the baby's side, so your infant won't be unnecessarily upset by a robotic voice or static sound we experience in some competitors. This straightforward unit is budget-friendly and perfect for almost any family. It can easily solve your audio monitoring requirements. This option has a shorter range than some other contenders, making it less suitable for larger homes or areas with more than four or five walls of separation between the nursery device and the parent device. However, if your home is compatible with the VTech Dem 221, then we think it is challenging to find a better sound-only product with higher quality sound and useful features than the VTech Dem 221. The number three position is held by Philips Avon Audio Baby Monitor. If you are looking for something simple that gets the job done, the Philips Avon DXC D5 101-10 is our favorite. It is a quality monitor that is easy to use and offers features such as impressive sound quality and sound activation. Sound activation is a feature we believe is important and useful in an audio monitor. This unit has a reasonable price, and it is straightforward enough that most grandparents can use it frustration-free. This simple sound monitor doesn't have many features. It lacks two-way communication and functions such as temperature sensors and lullabies. Unless you consider these features to be non-negotiable, we think most families stop using these features once the novelty wears off, making the lack of them less of a deal-breaker. In our opinion, we appreciate the look and ease of use the DECT CD5 101-10 provides and believe most parents will agree it's an excellent option for a reasonable price. Next at number 4 we have Hatch Rest Plus Baby Sound Machine. The Hatch Rest Plus is an app-enabled audio monitor with multiple other features for babies and parents, which makes it more appealing than the standard monitor. It offers sound filtering, sound machine, nightlight, toddler training clock, lullabies, and more. The nightlight is remote controlled and up to five smart devices can connect to a single monitor. This monitor includes two-way communication and Alexa compatibility. The Hatch Rest Plus uses Wi-Fi and requires an app to operate. You'll need a bit more tech-savvy abilities to get it up and running than a traditional baby monitor, but it isn't a struggle if you are comfortable with smartphones and products that use apps to operate. While the sound quality isn't the greatest for this monitor, it beats most of the video competition and we think the extras make it worth it. 
Overall, the Hatch Rest Plus is a cool nursery addition that can serve multiple purposes in one with a longer lifespan than some of the competition. The number 5 position is held by Nanit Pro Smart Baby Monitor. The Nanit Pro is a Wi-Fi baby monitor with movement monitoring capabilities designed more with nurseries in mind than much of the Wi-Fi competition. This camera is easy to use, uses the internet for connectivity virtually anywhere, and has many baby-centric features such as a nightlight. The Nanit Pro is one of the best options for parents looking for a monitor design especially for babies instead of a security camera. This baby monitor includes sensors for temperature and humidity. It features a nightlight and some nature sounds or white noise. The app has a user-friendly interface and will continue monitoring even if the screen is locked or while using another app. You can even take pictures or record and save videos of your little one. All of the baby-centered features make this monitor a good choice for parents who want a Wi-Fi monitor but are less concerned with longevity. This option mounts above the crib for a better view and can connect to Alexa. The Nanit Pro doesn't offer the best sound quality, but honestly, none of the video baby monitors we tested do. It is also one of the most expensive options in our video lineup. However, if you like the idea of a baby-centric video monitor designed for little ones, then the Nanit Pro is the one for your shortlist. The number 6 position is dominated by Google Nest Cam Indoor. The Nest Cam Indoor Wi-Fi camera is a cool camera that pairs with your smartphone or tablet. This easy-to-use camera has amazing visuals, can be viewed anywhere you have a connection, and has several useful features. The Nest Cam is good for baby watching, but it can also be used as a nanny cam or for security after your little one is older. We love that the Nest Cam has a reasonable price and can be used for many years to come retaining its value long after the standard monitoring device is no longer useful. Because the Nest Cam relies on an internet connection, it can fail if your internet is not reliable. So, if you'll experience sleepless nights worrying about connectivity or your internet connection, then you'll want to consider a dedicated option that works without the internet. However, if you have a large house, you could be restricted to Wi-Fi options only due to the range limitations of dedicated products. It also doesn't work while using other apps, so we recommend you have a single device you use only for monitoring to avoid losing your connection to the baby's room. For families looking for a product they can use for years to come that allows them to see little ones from outside the home, it is hard to beat this versatile camera. Moving on to the next and number seven with Hello Baby HB65 Baby Monitor. The Hello Baby HB65 camera is a dedicated video monitoring option for parents who want to view their baby but don't need Wi-Fi capable features. This unit has an easy to use plug and play design that works right out of the box with nothing to download or set up. We like the easy to use user interface and the sound activation that keeps the monitor quiet when the baby is sleeping. This increases a parent's ability to get a better night's sleep than a noisy device. This device does not have the same quality images and sound we saw on other competitors, but it does get the job done well and without a fuss. The sound is better than most video options, and it is good enough to hear what is accurately happening in the nursery. Overall, this is a good choice if you want an all-in-one monitor so your smart device is free for other things, and you don't want to view your little one away from home. The number 8 position is held by Snooza Hero, a C baby movement monitor. The Snooza Hero SC is a wearable movement baby monitor that clips to your baby's diaper. It has a unique vibration alert that aims to rouse little ones into moving to avoid the impending alarm that will sound audibly if the baby doesn't move. This vibration feature means that false alarms could be potentially less likely to result in a crying baby but they could cause a lack of deep sleep if they happen chronically. The Snooza Hero SE is a simple wearable that is easy to use, portable, and had few false alarms during our testing. While it is not a replacement for safe sleep practices, it could provide some parents with increased peace of mind for a better night's sleep. This unit only works until babies can roll or crawl. It can be uncomfortable for some babies or ineffective if your baby is too small or their diapers don't fit snugly in the waist. We worry parents will rely on this type of device to prevent SID, and therefore, caution that there is no evidence that it does or can prevent SID from occurring. However, if you want to know that your little one is moving at a predictable rate, and this knowledge will help you sleep better, then the Snooza Hero SE could be the best choice that won't break the bank or require mattress or crib adjustments. Next at number 9, we have Safe Sleep Under Mattress Baby Monitor. 
The Baybison 7 Movement product is a sensor pad mattress monitor that seems to have fewer false alarms than wearable products. The Baby Sense 7 is easy to use and doesn't require much setup or preparation outside of placing the sensor and control unit. This unit even works well after your baby learns to roll over. Unlike the wearable options that become less reliable as your little one's age, the Baby Sense 7 and other mattress sensors require a hard surface under the mattress to work, and they don't work with all mattress types, so you'll need to research your mattress to ensure it is compatible. This requirement means it also isn't suitable for travel. The Baby Sense 7 doesn't have a parent unit, which means an audible alarm will go off in the nursery to startle a sleeping baby. This design is intentional to stimulate the baby to wake up and brief but could be upsetting to a peaceful baby who is breathing fine. Overall, if you want a movement device that works well with a longer lifespan than a wearable option, then the Baby Sense 7 is a great choice with minimal fuss. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Owlet Extended Fabric Sock Pack for Smart Sock 3 Baby Monitor. The Owlet Smart Sock 3 is an app-enabled movement monitor baby wears on their foot. This wearable attaches easily and works better than older socks that typically fell off. This Owlet pairs with an app you download on your device and it is fairly intuitive and easy to navigate. The app can provide information including heart rate, baby zones, oxygen saturation, sleep quality, room temp, and more. It is also very portable, making it a good option for travel. The Alec 3 emits less EMF than V2, but it is still higher than competing wearables that don't use Wi-Fi. You'll need to decide if it is worth the extra EMF it creates. The Alec setup is also more convoluted than the competition. It has more steps than the clip-style wearables. The Alec is not a medical device, and you cannot use it to treat or monitor any medical condition. Overall, we believe some parents will love the additional information this baby monitor offers, finding peace of mind in the details they can't see. That's all for today. We upload baby product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.